the big match they're coming up with. What a great victory for Barricade here. Looking to get on this on a roll here. Trying to get some way to get to that British Commonwealth title or the uh, Canadian Championship. Fantastic. And what can you say about Abyss? He, he, he knows how to dominate a match. He knows how to take things to another level. But you know what? Abyss, Abyss is absolutely fantastic here. So is this guy, but that's beside the point here. Don't forget about, you know, he's a little, he's got a sad face right now. You know why? Because he doesn't have one of our shirts. Don't forget the uh, Front Row Mafia shirts available at whatamaneuver.net. There's more than just our shirts there. Don't forget about the sad pod. Don't forget about the Federation. All great shirts. Hey, you gotta like the Federation. Well, I do once in a while. But. Anyway, folks, coming up next, we have our fourth quarterfinal in the uh, Canadian Championship Classic. Not the Four Horsemen, but close enough. We have the number one seed, Joey Vendetta, the former ringside wrestling North American champion, taking on PWG and Wrestling from Hollywood, Wrestling Society X. I could list them off for weeks, what the accomplishments of this gentleman. Scorpio Sky, you guys are in for a treat. But let's take it up to Andre C here in the ring for the introductions for the next match. Folks, you're in for an absolute treat here. Oh, I stand corrected. Folks, Joey Vendetta, the former RCW Tag Team Champion, Ringside Wrestling North American Champion, who makes his seasonal residence in Kelowna. I guess it is a bit of an upgrade from Saskatchewan. Somehow he managed to will his way into the number one seed for this tournament. But unfortunately, due to the drawing of lots, uh, he really screwed up on this one. Now, folks, I've been talking this guy up on the Edmonton SBN Facebook page for a while here. Scorpio Sky, Wrestling Society X veteran, PWG veteran, Wrestling from Hollywood. And this guy has gone through so many battles. If you guys want to take a look, just his most recent big opponent he has is the current WWE Cruiserweight Champion, TJ Perkins. Fantastic matches he's had with him. And I am just thrilled to have him here in RCW. Hey, no checking out the women referees here. Come on. Who's cheer for Vendetta out there? Seriously. Ugh. And there's the bell. Folks, I've been waiting to see Scorpio Sky for a very long time. And some of the moves that he will pull off, you are not going to believe. He's not only quick, he is sudden out here, folks. Collar and elbow tie up. Back up into the corner. Vendetta with a clean break? That's kind of unusual. Vendetta has never found a shortcut that he hasn't enjoyed. Yeah, do it wouldn't do it twice. Give 
It wasn't that close to it. Come on now. Oh, beautiful sweep of the leg there. Now going into that arm bar. Taking control of the wrist and the arm here. Typically with a lot of the arm locks and holds that he has. It's a body part you want to focus on. Vendetta hammerlock in the arm. What's Scorpio doing? Nice reversal here. to take out the arm. Oh. oh! That might have taken a shoulder out of soccer here, driving the knee right into this, the tricep and the bicep area there. Snapmare takeover. Oh, he's got him again. Oh, right in the bicep again. Got him down for the cover here. One, two. Referee Sierra with a two count here. Once again, focusing back on that shoulder. Got him up. Spin around. Where's he coming down? Oh! Huge backbreaker here and all that pressure right on the middle of the back. Look at the power here. Oh, and again. I am surprised Vendetta's not in half right now. Come down with the cover. Only a two count, but you can. You can see the ring savviness here, Scorpio Sky with the forearm right in the face. May not, may not help with the cover, but it certainly is going to piss off your opponent. From the corner, big clothesline. What's Sky going to do to follow up here? Missile drop kick. One, two, just a two count. Vendetta's had what people have said a rather easy uh, trip here to the playoffs. A lot of matches with Steven Styles and uh, the Texas Hangman and whatnot. Flipped off the ropes here. Kick to the gut. Oh, hot shot right in the top rope. Vendetta's found a rather easy way to get into the playoffs here, but this has got to be definitely without a doubt its toughest challenge to date. Snap the takeover. And a good old fashioned boot right outside the face. Ronnie Garvin would be proud of that stomp there. Got him back up. Oh, shoves his head right in that turnbuckle. And now this is the typical Joey Vendetta ground and pound attack here. Vendetta using every last second of that five count. I thought she counted five at that point. What's Vendetta gonna do here? Off the ropes. Nice back elbow right across the bridge of the nose. Cover one, two. Draping down that left shoulder. Now into the reverse bear hug. Just trying to wear out any kind of momentum Scorpio has here. Scor Scorpio just fading away here in this quarterfinal match, the Canadian Championship Classic here at the Springbrook Multiplex. This is our semi-main event, folks. Coming up next, we're going to have Dick Richards making his triumphant return to Springbrook, taking on Michael Richard Blaze. Scorpio trying to get back up to his feet here. Oh, 
shot to the face, and again, coming off the ropes. Into the gut, that's gonna cut back any momentum here. What's Vendetta doing? Oh, I should have known. Trying to show his uh, Kelowna greatness here. One, two. Just a two count. You know that's not going to happen without hooking the leg here. Now going to the body scissors. Once again, focusing on trying to wear down Scorpio Sky. Just trying to put some extra pressure here. Trying, trying to make it hard to breathe. I, I find it rather ironic that Vendetta is asking comments about school here. I think he... Grade 12 was probably the best eight years of his life at this point. Oh, what do we got here? Uh-oh! Beautiful reversal! Vendetta, he can't tap out, he's gonna have to... This guy breaks the hold. He's gotta be lacking in energy here. All this wearing down by Vendetta. And then just a good old fashioned shot to the face there. Has that ever worked in the history of wrestling? Seriously. This crowd really getting on the nerves of uh, Joey Vendetta here. Vendetta with that cravat. And into that chin lock here. Controlling the neck, controlling the head. Scorpio Sky here just He's gotten this unique shot coming in, coming into RCW this weekend. He gets a shot at the heavyweight championship in this tournament. Throwing some elbows here, trying to get some separation. A forearm right to the face. Oh! That's all right. Drop kick right on the money there. Scorpio throws that out out of nowhere. Referee Sierra making the count. Up to four here. Both wrestlers have a 10 count here to get up. Count of six. Shot to the face. This guy's getting him fruiting first. Off the ropes, reversal. Beautiful sunset flip, one, two. Just a two, oh! Just shove face down in the middle, oh ho oh, oh. What a kick! I thought that was it. I'd say Joey's brains are scrambled, but we all, yeah, never mind, folks. This guy's gotta follow up here. Guy's measuring him up. Got him up. Fireman's carry. Trying to go for that stunner. Blocked. Falcon arrow. One, two. Just a two count. That that looked like a wounded condor head lying on the canvas there, right there, but. Sky manages to shoot that right shoulder up. But Vendetta once again in full control. Oh! High knee! Uh-oh. Going for a half and half? Uh-oh. He's got him. Huge power bomb there. Oh, he gets a two count out of it. Sorry, folks, a little speechless there. It's a blue thunder bomb. I'm glad I got security helping me out with this here. <laughs> oh, 
All right, Doy Vendetta trying to get back up to his feet here. Vendetta taking his time here, and that might cost him. Oh, kick upside the head. Oh, beautiful. Give that side neck breaker. Version of a parachute there. That beautiful neck breaker coming down. Coming down here. Uh oh. Sky setting him up. Could this be? Good for that bicycle kick. The Vendetta eats the double boot in the corner. Oh! Vendetta throws the referee into the ropes, knocking Scorpio down. Oh, knee upside the head. How does Vendetta always gonna find a cheap way to win? Honestly, Joey Vendetta finds a cheap way every time. You managed to break the code here and get that victory. Scorpio Sky, a hell of a performance and deserved a lot better fate. But now we have our three semi-finalists. I don't know how this is gonna work out. We got Dylan Knight, we got Scott Justice, and we got Joey Vendetta here. I believe following the conclusion of this match, there is going to be a drawing of lots as we bring it back up here to Broadcast Central. Now, I just got word from RCW head office that there's going to be a drawing of lots following the conclusion of this event to determine who gets the bite of the final. So, it's a bit of a wild card here, folks, but I, I will have to say here, folks, Joey Vendetta steals a victory. Scorpio Sky himself deserves a better fate here. Put on one hell of a performance. But coming up next, this is the main event of the evening. This is the this is the match everybody's been dying to see. It, it is the rematch from a year ago. Michael Richard Blaze uses a fake injury into a super kick roll up for the one, two, three. Check out the Edmonton Sports Podcast Network or the Best of Dick DVD for highlights of that match. But the rematch is coming up just next. And it looks like I might have some help for this All right match. now, Mr. The Ref, I have sat here uh, very respectfully letting you handle your business. Uh, phenomenal job. But when it comes to Michael Richard Blaze, I feel like I should get involved and I apologize for stepping on your toes. My name is Big Red Boris. I work for PWA Wrestling and when it comes to Michael Richard Blaze, I consider myself somewhat of an expert. I want to make one thing, two things clear. Number one, Michael Richard Blaze is a horrible person. Agreed. Number two, Michael Richard Blaze is a phenomenal athlete. Agreed. And there's a lot of exciting things coming up for Michael Richard Blaze, and that's why I find it very interesting that he's here in Red Deer tonight, working for RCW, considering the things that are coming up for him in PWA, and I apologize for sticking my nose in your business, but I feel it needs to be said. Folks, one thing about... One thing about... If it's an SPN, we're not afraid to cross borders here, and that's why I'm glad I got Big Bad Boris with me. But it looks like we're going to go to the internet. And I'd like to thank RCW for having me at the event tonight.